Harvey, a bit of a disappointing start. Not, yeah. not an easy one for you to talk about, but a disappointing start. Yeah, not at all. I think, um, obviously, we started really well getting the early goal, but I think maybe we let a bit of complacency creep into our game. And obviously, when you concede the first, it's about it's done you learn from your mistakes and I think that's what we didn't do today and obviously the first turned into the second and the gaffer doesn't he doesn't teach that that's not his standard so I think we need to learn from that quickly and obviously next week put it right it's you talked here about not being the gaffer standards mm. but the standards that you have set in the mm. league cup campaign yeah. that wasn't what it was not to be either yeah I think as I said before we just need to learn quickly it's one of those days where you're just gonna have to forget about it and move on to the next but yeah you're right as players we don't have those standards where we're much we're, we're a better group than that so I think yeah next week we just have to come out and put it right you should say you got off to a great start with a goal in the first couple of minutes yeah. but then when they equalise and then get themselves in front they make it very difficult don't yeah. they obviously when you do concede the first second third you allow teams to sit behind the ball and that's what they do and then when they do have 11 men all behind the ball it becomes quite difficult to break down so yeah it's just we kill ourselves when we give away those early goals it sounds strange, but mm. it was the fourth goal really that yeah. killed it because mm. I think that kind of finished it, didn't yeah. it? And it's a sloppy goal to concede because you don't get any real pressure on the goal and it's, it's, it's way too easy. And as I said before, the gaffer doesn't teach that, so we need to do better as a group. You've come into the club. Mm. How are you finding it? I've loved it so far, honestly. Um, Marv is brilliant. He drives standards every single day and he's so demanding. And I think um, my first week when I came here, maybe I was just expected to be able to like get away with things in training but you quickly find that you can't do that and um it's an environment where you go in every day and you genuinely feel like you're improving every single day you're getting sharper you're getting better and you're learning so yeah it's been brilliant for me so far your pace obviously mm. you, you can see you're mm -hmm. fast is yeah. that what you're going to bring to the team then? yeah of course speed but i think there's other areas where i can improve but also i can add something in terms of like my end product my delivery into the box my ability to go on both sides i think i I'm not just pace, but I also understand that I need to develop other areas of my game because people will just know me for being direct and being quick. But yeah, there's a lot more than I can that I can bring than just pace, definitely. You come up from Aldershot. Mm. Is it what you expected? Um, to be fair, like English football is very physical, and I found up here it's um you've got a lot of really good technical players, but not necessarily as many good like physical athletes, if that makes sense. But the games, the standard of the games are good. So, yeah, definitely, it's what I expected, yeah. You talked about the group of players mm -hmm. you've got here. You know, today, is it just a bump in the road? Maybe a yeah, reality check? Yeah, I think check? so, yeah. We'll regroup on Monday and then go and put it right next week, definitely. Edinburgh City, obviously, mm -hmm. you probably haven't played up nah. there. Big, wide-open park, mm. so something to, to look forward to. Yeah, definitely, and as I said, just need to go there and put it right, definitely, yeah.